What is up guys, Demo the Warrior here, and welcome to this um, update video. Now, I haven't really been posting consistently on my channel, I haven't really been uploading much of really anything lately, and there's a couple reasons why, and this is why I wanted to do this update video. As you can probably hear, it's echoey in here because my room is under construction right now getting changed so that's one reason why I haven't really recorded anything and uploaded it and then there's just been a whole lot of just really personal stuff um, so first of all I just want to say I'm sorry for not uploading and you know you guys have been asking me to stream asking what I'm going to stream again I feel like you guys feel that I've been ignoring you, it's just, I've had a lot going through my head lately, um, and I'm sorry, um, because, you know, I, it's taken me a bit to realize that, you know, you guys, I, I actually have people, I actually have subscribers, people that actually really fucking care you know, people that message me, people that, you know, you guys watch every stream that I do, and I've just been neglecting, and I'm sorry. Um, so, we're real close to a thousand subs. Uh, last time I checked, it was 961. Uh, it could be more now, I don't know at this moment, but... We're almost there, but I kind of want to get into the reasons why I haven't been uploading. As I said, my room is under construction right now. Uh, if I can show you, this would be a nice little, I guess, time capsule for me in future years. Uh, my hair is wet. I just got a shower. Just got home from work. You can see my room is completely bare and white right now. A uh, lot of stuff is being worked on, repainted, new flooring, new lights, new everything. So, yeah, that's one reason that I haven't uploaded. And then another reason, I'm not going to go super, super into detail with it. Um, so, my aunt is in the hospital. And she has been diagnosed with leukemia. And it has been really hard on me and my family and has caused a lot of personal issues with not just my immediate family, but with like my entire family. It's just a whole mess and, you know, I'm the aunt that's in the hospital, I'm my aunt Tammy, I'll just say her name, fuck it, um, you know, I've been really close to her all my life, and, you know, she, for a good part of my life, she was like a mom to me, and it's nothing against my mom, it's just, you know, my mom was just working all the time when I was little, so I was spending time with my aunt all the time, and it's crazy to think about three weeks to a month ago, I was with my aunt going out to eat, and, you know, having a good time with her. And then all of a sudden, you know, last week we find this out and it's just been really heavy on all of us and it's been weighing on my mind a lot. It's been, it's been hard. I don't know if it's fully hit me yet, but it's, it's heavy. Um, so yeah, that's the major reason why I haven't uploaded anything. It's just that mixed with you know, my room being worked on, and other stuff that I'm not going to get into. Um, so yeah, I just wanted to apologize for not uploading, but I hope you all understand why. Um, so yeah, uh, all the prayers in the world go out to my aunt. I hope she gets better, and I hope she gets through this and gets over it. Hopefully. Praying for the best. Um, yeah, so that's pretty much why I haven't been uploading, and I apologize, but I hope you understand why. Um, 
It has been this thing that's been going on for a couple weeks now. Like, this whole situation just happened out of nowhere. And it's just been really hard on my family, but we're doing the best we can. But, uh, yeah, on to some uh, better news. Well, not news, but something else I wanted to discuss since this is an update video. Uh, I wanted to give you an update on some f ideas I had that I want to do. And I uh, also... Oh, fucking hair. I uh, also had a question for you, my subscribers. Um, so, as we are nearing 1,000 subscribers on this channel, I wanted to ask you guys, I asked it in the stream and nobody answered me because we were just fucking around and joking, but um, I seriously want to know, like, what do you guys want to see when um, we finally hit 1,000 subscribers on this channel? I haven't really thought of anything. Uh, wh what do you guys want to see me do for 1,000 subscribers? Because we're getting close and, you know, I don't want to be lazy and fucking miss the mark or some shit. But, yeah, what do you guys want to see when I get to, we get to 1,000 subs? However the fuck you want me to say it. Was, all these YouTubers, you know, they want to say, they want to say we, but they're not really involved with their audience and, you know, they make sure they say we because they feel like if, if they say I, they feel selfish. And, you know, I just, I say we and I because, you know, it's my channel, but it's also your guys' channel too. You know, I share this with you. So, so if you get offended with me saying, you know, I sometimes or we sometimes, it's just how I say it. But, um, yeah. So what do you guys want to see for a thousand subscribers? Um, and I also had some other ideas of stuff I was wanting to do. I've been, you know, at work, I'm, I can listen to like podcasts and stuff and listen to music at work while I work. I just say work a bunch of times. Um, <laughs> but, uh, yeah, and I was, I was listening to the, uh, Smackdown vs. Raw 2006 and 2009 soundtrack and it was, making me think back on all the wrestling games I played and how wrestling has been a big part of my life and I really started brainstorming some ideas uh, if any of you know my second channel which you probably don't it's called demo plays I did a couple videos on there where I did reviews I guess I don't know why I, I put review in the title it's not really a review it's just me fucking playing the game goofing around with some stupid shit um just like me playing just cheap ass fucking games that I bought and you know, just having fun, but, uh, yeah, so those videos are basically a thing I want to take into the future, um, so in that video, I have my dog with me, Bailey, the bulldog, English bulldog, and, you know, I kind of, I watch people, like, relax, relax, and John Tron, how they kind of have, like, an animal companion, and I know if it ever becomes a thing, people are going to make comparisons, but, you know, I kind of wanted to have, like, a review or kind of, like, videos like they kind of do. If any of you know Relax Relax or John Tron, uh, stuff like that. Um, I wanted to have, like, an animal companion type deal where I can use that animal as a character. And I, I've been really thinking about it. And my idea that I have is that... I want to, I had two ideas. One, I wanted to do this uh, Fuck 2K series where, like, I do separate videos on different topics about, like, 2K, why I hate it. So basically one video would be, like, uh, I would call it, like, the Fuck 2K series. And, and for those of you who don't know, by the way, I fucking hate 2K. 2K is a terrible, terrible game developer. They need to just stick to NBA and leave wrestling games alone because... Yeah, just fuck 2K. But uh, 2K banned me from community creations, and I'll never get over that. Fuck them for that. It was wrong because I didn't do anything wrong. But that's besides, besides the point, I hate 2K for more reasons than just that. So I was thinking, like, one video could be, like, you know, like, comparing the soundtrack on 2K games compared to the soundtracks on the old games. And, like, say, compare it. One video could be, like, comparing, like gameplay compared to 2k games 
stuff like that and maybe like content or online like comparison kind of or something like that and call it like the fuck 2k series but like pretty much just be like the videos will just be like oh uh you know it's a comparison of the older games and 2k and this is why the older games are better because 2k is garbage but yeah i was thinking something like that or i was thinking something to where maybe i'm trying to remember how i was thinking about it it would be like maybe like reviews of old wrestling games kind of but with a different twist on it i'm not exactly sure what that is but it'd basically be like you know uh a kind of informative experience of me you know the games i review i'll tell my experience with it and like i could have my dog as a character in it kind of like relax relax does in his reviews and like john tron stuff like that because I, I i really enjoy it those kind of videos and i really wanted to try it and you know i wanted to take that and add my own spin on it with wrestling games because you really don't see that many people reviewing wrestling games you know there's been nicotine who i wish would uh, upload more because he's fucking great um but his doesn't really have any comedy to it it's just you know straight up informative review and i like that um and then you have lion's edge who the dude hasn't posted in god knows how long i don't know what happened to him he was like one of the first people to start reviewing wrestling games um and then he's just gone i don't know what happened to him and then you have uh the great one or greatness of wrestling who has started reviewing wrestling games. There's some other people that have reviewed them, but I kind of wanted to add like a comedic twist on the mind, like wrestling game reviews with like different like characters and stuff, or maybe different like comedy style involved with it. It's something I've really been thinking about, and I think it could be a really fun thing to do. Probably will take a lot of editing, uh, but I think it would be something that. I would enjoy doing and you guys would enjoy watching so basically what I would do is is like um, my dog would be like my companion and it would be be like a character and I would like put text on the screen for her to talk or whatever like Alex does with his cat because I, I really like the style he does that in um, so I would want to like do that but have my own spin on it and basically review the game but in a funny way, if that makes sense. If it doesn't, fuck me, I guess. But yeah, I've, I've, I was really thinking about it, and I'm like, that would I, that could be a fun idea because I, I like I love wrestling. It's my passion. Um, you know, actually, like for real wrestling, like getting in there wrestling myself isn't really my passion anymore. It used to be, but now it's kind of different. Like. Wrestling games have kind of a passion to me, like creating people and, you know, playing wrestling games is kind of a passion for me. And like the stuff I do with uh, my backyard company, BWGP, like editing for that and doing all that is a passion for me. Uh, and wrestling in general is just a passion for me. Um, and I wanted to take that and I know like the wrestling content is what gets the most views and traction on this channel. I'm not looking for views by any means, but I'm saying is it seems like that's the kind of content that people watch the most. That's the kind of content that you guys like, so that's the kind of content I should deliver. You know, I like trying all types of different stuff, but the wrestling content always seems to be the thing that sticks. And, you know, I'll still stream and stuff, but just so you guys know, like, I'm going to be frankly honest with you, um, I'm kind of tired of... 2k19 now i'm not saying i'm gonna stop playing 2k19 or anything like that or stop streaming it all i'm saying is is there's only you know so many times that you can go through the same community creations and you know stream the same game before it gets old to you if that makes sense and it's not like the game is that fucking great anyway because 2k is garbage but besides the point i'll save my hate for 2k for later but yeah so, like, uh, to just be honest with you, like, I, I would love to stream other stuff, but I feel like you guys won't watch it. Like, I streamed Bully. A couple people watched, uh, you know, just st maybe stream. I wish I could stream older wrestling games, but I don't have a fucking capture card, and I'd have to do it through my PC and all this other garbage, and I just don't want to do that. Uh, 
But yeah, I'm kind of getting tired of 2K19. It's just so repetitive and just getting old and boring and it's stale. I mean, that's what happens with 2K's games every year, but like I said, that's besides the point. Um, so yeah, those are some things I want to try going forward. So uh, I don't know when those things will start since I got this whole reconstruction thing going on and everything with my aunt, but I do plan on doing it in the near future. But what do you guys want to see for a thousand subs and which idea do you like better? Cause I'm, I'm going to try both and see what, what you guys like more. Um, and for all my uh, loyal viewers, the people who watch every stream, uh, I'm going to try and name your names off the top of my head. I'm probably not going to be able to name everybody. Um, Humza Ali, who uh, I've actually like been talking to and stuff. Your shouts out to you. You're a cool dude. Uh, love you, man. You know I love my subscribers. Uh, uh, what's his name? Austin the artist. Shouts out to you, man. Um, I don't I don't know what his name is on PS4, but my dude Gage Penton or G Gamer Gage, whatever. Uh, Shouts out to you. I'm trying to remember everybody. There's like uh, Fat Boy XD. I don't remember what your name is on PS4. Shouts out to you, man. Um, now I'm kind of on the spot with this, and I can't think of people's names. Uh, that one guy you love. I know you've been on my channel a lot. Uh, shouts out to you, man. Um, like. There's people I'm thinking of, but I can't remember their freaking gamer tag or their name. Shit, I'm trying to think. Oh, fuck. <laughs> um, whoever M Miguel is, I remember Miguel something was on a couple streams. Shout out to you. I can't remember his name right now. Um... But yeah, shouts out to all you guys and shouts out to everybody else that watches my streams and that's there every time. I really appreciate you guys. Um, it's kind of a weird thing for me that, you know, people actually care about what I'm doing or, you know, they actually care to watch my streams and actually will like sit there and, you know, watch me for like two, three hours. I'm starting to lose my voice because I'm fucking thirsty, but. Yeah, th thank you guys. Uh, shouts out to all you guys. I love you guys. Um, yeah, I blinked for a second, but yeah. Uh, in the end, I'm just sorry for not posting, but I hope you all understand why I haven't been posting. Got some ideas coming that I'm going to try out. You guys let me know in the comments what you want to see. And for the out of those two ideas I talked about, and what do you guys want to see for 1,000 subscribers? Let me know so I can uh, start brainstorming on it and see what I can do with your guys' ideas of what to do for 1,000 subs. Um, and if you guys suggest I stream 2K19 for 1,000 subs, I don't know if I want to do that for 1,000 subs. Maybe. It depends on what we do on there. Um, just saying, maybe think of something else besides 2K19. And you can suggest it if you want, but I'm just saying, uh, I would rather maybe do something else than 2K19, but it's whatever, whatever you guys want me to do, uh, I never even thought I'd even get close to this amount of people subscribed to me on anything, honestly. Like, I started this channel back in 2014. Um, summer of 2014, I've had two channels before, one was Halo Gamer one, Halo Gamer 119 in 2013, and in 2012, uh, was the first time I was ever on YouTube as Callmaster123456, both channels are still up on YouTube, if you want to look them up, I could probably link them in this video, the, they, the links will be in the description down below, because I'm going to link them, but if you guys wanted to check out my way old stuff, if that's even of any interest, to let you know I sound like a fucking five-year-old and on my Call Master channel. And Haley Gamer 119 was the channel I thought was going to get to this level where it is now. 
And then I, for whatever reason, both times I got logged out of my account and couldn't remember the password. So then I made this channel and I just posted like random gameplays. You'll see like Mario Kart Double Dash gameplay and then like Left 4 Dead gameplays and just random stuff. Because I wasn't really sure what I wanted to do at the time. I just started uploading. And I remember when I first started this channel, I was thinking like at that time, I was like, you know, I'm just going to make, this is the last time I'm making a channel. And if this one doesn't work out, then I'm done. I remember thinking that when I first made it and I never thought it would get this far. And, you know, I, I was at like a hundred something subscribers, I think. And that took like four years just to get to that. And then that one fateful morning at 10 AM or 10 30, whatever it was, I made that 2k18 video. And since then things haven't been the same. That video blew up. It still has like 40 something thousand views, which I never in my wildest dreams thought something that I made would get that many views. You know, I, I am a tiny, tiny, tiny YouTuber compared to half the people on this site. But, you know, all this stuff is still amazing to me and it's still shocking to me. And I just never would have in a million years expected this. I wouldn't have ever thought of this. I never thought that I would have people that actually would want to watch me and actually, you know, care and, you know, watch a that keep coming back and watching me and that I actually talk to and you know I never thought I, that I would have that and now that I do have that I'm grateful for it and hopefully we do nothing but go up and expand from here um so yeah thank all you guys um you may have wondered about all the content that's been uploaded. It'll be, you know, just a random video here, like the video where me and Brandon were climbing up the hills. Those are at the uh, park by my house. Um, and, you know, like the random Mario Party videos or random video here, random skit here. You know, it's just all been, mainly it's been an escape for me from all that's been going on is mostly what this channel has been for the longest time. It has been like just an escape from reality for me because like my reality kind of sucks to be honest with you, but it is what it is. You know, I'm grateful for all the friends I do have. And you know, there's times where I sit there and I'll look at the negative that's going on and just all this negative stuff is happening to me and then you know I, I never really sit and look at the positives and then I'll, sometimes I'll sit there and I'll be like you know what I got all this negativity but look at the stuff that's going right BWGP is doing good you know we have all these amazing matches we're getting good views on them you know my YouTube channel is doing okay you know I got people that I actually watch you know so that's stuff to be proud of you know, stuff that I put hours of editing into is somewhat, I guess, successful. <sighs> you know, I'm tired after work, but, uh, yeah, no, I just, you know, think of the positives of everything that's going on. I, I got, I got the best friends that a person could ask for. And, you know, these guys have really become my family in a way. I know this is supposed to be an update video, but, you know, I just wanted to update you guys on the channel and just everything that's going on and why I haven't been uploading and my ideas I have. And, you know, I also kind of kind of wanted to use this as a message. You know, I've never went through anything like this before with somebody having cancer, but I know a lot of people have and it's a terrible, awful, hard thing to go through. And, you know, I, I don't even know what to say, but it's just a really difficult thing to go through. Uh, I mean, my grandma has had cancer a couple times, like a long time ago, but that was when I was little and I didn't really understand the magnitude 
of what was going on. And I don't think I still fully understand it, but I understand it more so than I did back then. But, uh, yeah, cancer sucks. You know, uh, fuck cancer and fuck 2K. I'll stop. But fuck cancer, seriously. Um... Yeah, for everybody out there that has somebody that's going through cancer, or that has went through cancer, I, I know, well, not that has went through cancer, but has had somebody that went through cancer, I am feeling your pain right now. Uh, for those who uh, went through cancer, I haven't felt your pain, and I don't want to, and hopefully that never happens, but yeah, it's a terrible thing just try to stay as positive as you can and that's really all you can do whatever happens happens but uh yeah i'm just rambling on now but i i, I really want to give a shout out to my friends because they've been for most times a reason that i haven't done a lot of bad things and a lot of dark things that i've thought about there has been a few times where I had thought about uh, suicide and my friends have been there for me and sometimes I feel like I just don't I just don't show my appreciation for them and I, I love these guys to death I love them so much and they're my brothers and you know they're one of one of the only things that's you know been keeping me going so I just want to shout out my best friend, Tony. I love you to death, man. Uh, you know him as RobCore.Nation. Such a great fucking guy. I could, I could never put into words how I feel about the dude. I can never put into words how much I love and appreciate him. So I, I, I love you so much, Tony. Um, my other best friend, Brandon... You guys know him as Brandon Champion. Dude is someone I can just hang out with and just have a good time with no matter what. And we laugh and joke around and uh, laugh and joke around about the dumbest, absolute most stupidest shit we can. And he's been there for me a lot as well. And I love you, Brandon. I really appreciate all the times you've talk to me and help me through stuff and I'm just really thankful for you man um my friend Cody uh, you guys may know him as Raven from my uh Fortnite with Brandon Champion at Raven series I, I love you Cody you're a great dude uh I love when we go over to your house and do all the wrestling events. You're just such a chill dude. Like, I've never seen you angry ever. And, like, you just... I don't even know how to put it into words. You're just so welcoming. And, you know, your family's just so welcoming. And you're just such a nice person. Like... You know, I'm not as close with Cody as I am with other people but I still love you man um my friend Howard I love you Howard I'm fucking saying this shit like it's a goodbye message I'm, I'm not it's just I'm trying to show some appreciation for my friends um Howard uh better known as Exodus Creed not with two O's just one I fuck it up all the time but my man Creed who has never appeared on my channel but it's whatever. Um, there was one point I really started getting close with him. But, you know, just life happens. But uh, love you, Howard. I'm thankful for you, man. There's been many a time when I've had so much fun hanging out with you and our legendary Raw 2 roster. My God. And the times you... Just made all kinds of jokes about Ungar TV or Reloaders TV, whatever they go by now. Just a, a man with a sense of humor that I haven't seen anywhere else. Such a great guy.
Um, my friend Austin, better known as Austin Anarchy. Uh, at first, I wasn't like I knew Austin, but I wasn't really close with him. And over time, I feel like I really started getting closer to Austin. Um, I love you, man. It's fun. It's so much fun to play Smash Bros with you. It is one of the funnest things in the world to play Smash Bros with you and like you know, understand how much like uh, when me, you, and Tony did the Smash tournaments, like how much that you know helped me, you know, be in a better mood and actually have some happiness, and it you know it it just helped me in my life, bringing like positivity towards me. And, just being an overall great friend. I, I love you, man. Um, my friend, uh, James, better known as Anthony Herring. Uh, you guys, he, ha he has been on my channel in the form of being in that fan Halloween fan film. He's in that. Uh, I love you, man. We don't hang out nearly as much as we used to, but... I really miss hanging out with you, but, uh, yeah, you're, you're a great dude, and I hope all the best happens for when you go off to the military, but, yeah, I love you, I love you, man, um, make sure to hit him with that two-piece, woo-woo, but, um, I know that was cringy, but, uh, yeah, um, my dude Ryan, uh, better known as Drew Stokes, I love you man, such a, such a funny fucking dude, and such a cool dude to be around, like, you, you just add a sense of coolness to whatever situation you're in, I don't know what it is, but I love you man, um, who was I thinking of, I just blanked, I don't even know, um, yeah, I'm thankful for all you guys. Uh, Dominic Spizak, even though I don't know you that well, and I've only recently met you, like, a couple months ago, you, know, you seem you seem like a really nice dude. I, I haven't hung out with you, but, you know, I, I appreciate you, man. You're, you know, anytime we're doing the events, you're a super nice guy. And yeah, I appreciate you, man. Um... Yeah, th thank you guys all so much. You guys really helped me get through life a lot of times. And I really just wanted to dedicate this section of this video to you guys. Because I feel like I just haven't shown my appreciation for you guys enough. And, you know, this is a really, like, bad time in my life right now. And you guys...